Hello, this is Gray Hughes, and believe it or not, even today, I am still not Matthew Rose. Believe it or not, that's still going around out there. They also think I might be Fractal Truth, who I don't even know personally, but he did help me contact Matthew Rose to get my external hard drive. He is, after all, the FOIA attorney. I'm also not a host of many other people that people say I am. I'm actually Gray Hughes. It's unbelievable, but true. So let me show you what I deal with on a daily basis. It's pretty amazing. All right, so first of all, let's just get this out of the way. I am Gray Hughes. Here's a case I've been working on, uh, the Jonathan Cruz case. This one, to me, is a murder, and I think this girl here murdered her boyfriend at the time. He was just breaking up with her that night, and they find him dead on the bed, shot through the heart at a left-to-right downward angle, and he's right-handed, and he had no gunshot residue on, on uh, I think, his left hand. And, you know, very little residue on him at all, but, but uh, the girlfriend, Brenda, had residue all over both hands, all right? And as you can see, here's one of the reenactments on Crime Watch Daily, and right here it says, Reenactment by Gray Hughes. You see that? I didn't just put that in there. This, I'm scrolling by a web page here. Animation by Gray Hughes. All the way through. And then when you click on the link, it actually goes to my YouTube channel. Oh my goodness. You know, it kind of sucks to have to do all these all the time. You know, because people just don't want to believe who you are. All right, so if you go to the playlist here, and then here's the Jonathan Cruz playlist. Four hundred thousand right. um, dollar. This is uh, some uh, of the videos that I've made to, on this you know, case. Remodel the clinic. Um, I was like, "What?" He was you like, know, "This is a yes, video right here that's so playing." We're all excited. You know, we it's actually one of, the um, it's one of the first consensus. Let's see if I can scroll so down. we're one of the oldest clinics. You know, the way they look. All the new ones are really, really nice. So we were like, "Oh my God, we're finally but, uh, gonna get remodeled." Anyways, he was like, "Yes, we got our approved." I'm close out of that. But you can go to my. You know, YouTube channel, look, that, in, so look up Jonathan Cruz and you look at all that. the animations I've made. Some of them aren't, you can't see them because they were set to unlisted because they were just for me to share with somebody. All right. All right, so let's get back to this video here. See, here's a guy, he's claiming that I am not being truthful here. Listen to this. This is why this camera jumps because now they now they edit, edit in the time. Take a look at this. Look, boom. And she jumps, bam, Boom. she's there. Bam. Okay, that. You know, he's really working on his straight drops. That, that right if there, he gets a few more of those in. That. Oh, my God, look at look. Boom, 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 bam, bam, bam. Look at, look at, look at, look at. Like People will believe it. You Without know? being seen coming from there. Or oh, what was um the explanation, Gary? Yeah, my, my name's Gray. Oh, um, these it's not Gary, cameras, but feel free to call me Gary because yeah, I don't if, care if you know what my name is. It doesn't pick you up. Well, how about the security guard who's running back and forth? He's, he's seen yeah, yeah, yeah. running all the way over Okay, there. so about basically what this guy is saying How about everybody is else that he thinks that I'm taking out time. And he believes that Kanika was actually there at 225, okay? But he doesn't understand that these cameras, almost all the cameras in the hotel are motion activated only, okay? They have motion sensing where the red box shows up. Now, if you actually pay attention to the videos, you can see what's going on. Um, I called Vivotech up, the USA, Vivotech USA. I actually got the number, believe it or not, off of watching one of Kate 420's videos. And I called, and um, I've spoken with them twice now because there's still some things that I need clarification on. But one thing is that you can set a buffer on the recordings. Okay, so... When motion sensed, it actually goes back 10 seconds. So that means it's all it's always recording. You know, I don't know if it's in memory or what what it's doing. I guess she did tell actually she did tell me that it records back over itself if there's no motion. So it's always recording like um, 10 seconds, 10 seconds, 10 seconds, and it just keeps going over itself, or what or whatever you set your buffer to. And then as soon as the red light, you know, the uh, red square comes up detecting motion 
it starts recording and then adds in the previous nine or ten seconds or what, whatever you said is the buffer okay and then as soon as that motion leaves the scene the red box disappears it still records for another 10 seconds as well okay and that's just how these work and sometimes like in the case where Kanika just shows up here that's because the red box didn't come on until she was over here and then if if you rewind count back 10 seconds she's only right there there's a blind spot right over here okay there there's no motion uh, there's no uh, camera that was recording her when she was just kind of at the bottom of that ramp over there okay so there was like a 10 second period where she came up uh, you know where there was no recording at all and then she got to here and then there's 10 seconds prior let me let me show you how this works okay that might be kind of confusing to actually listen to so I'm gonna open up uh, the Toshiba hard drive go to the ninth and then this is called the lower level lobby stairs all right now watch what I'm gonna I'm gonna show you this and it, it just makes total sense and I hope this is doesn't keep being brought up over and over again it's not glitching it's not some crazy um, editing going on it's just this is the compilation of all of the motion now watch he's got you've got the uh, the red box on him now watch right when the red box goes away it's 35 36 now watch I'm gonna say at 45 it'll move on to the next motion watch 42 43 44 45 yep it was 44 so nine seconds All right now we've got the next motion coming on I don't, I don't know where okay so here he comes back onto this this uh, screen so if you were to count backwards nine or ten seconds from when the first red box came on that's when um, that's how long the buffer was prior all right let's just move it forward to Kanika all right so I think this is just after the security guard yeah you, the security guard runs by now notice he's running so you can see his movement because the nine seconds includes that and he's moving quickly even if you walk fast you'll be on there but Kanika wasn't moving quickly all right now there's Kanika see how she just showed up right there now watch this let's just look at this watch when you see the red box okay red box showed up at 42 all right so right there the red box showed up now let's go back in time okay now 34 is right when it, she showed up on there let's watch that again okay 34 so it should be like uh 43 ish when the red box yeah 42 43 you know so it's eight nine seconds there's a buffer they said in there Now, if you notice, right when she leaves this shot, it'll count for another eight or nine seconds again. So let's just watch that. See, the red box is on her, and then the next red box below will pick her up, because that's a different quadrant. Now, as soon as the red box disappears, start counting. Okay, 11. So I'm going to guess at 21, it'll skip to the next clip. 21 or 22. Boom, it was right on 21. See that? 10 seconds. Okay, now the, these these people right here, right there was when they were picked up, so you could see them re being recorded seconds before. Now watch, right when they turn this corner, they're being picked up by the uh, motion sensor. Now right when the red box disappears, start counting, and you'll see it. Okay, so it was 21. So I'm going to guess at 31, this skips to the next clip, unless somebody else shows up. 29, 30. Oh, it was 30. So that was nine seconds that time. So you see that? That's how this stuff works. Now here's that, that blonde lady walking around. Same thing's going to happen here. Okay, there's a red box. The red box. Oh, yes. I think she spent some time looking at a painting or something here. I can't remember. Okay, now she's heading up towards the lobby right now. So right there, it disappeared at 35. Or actually, it was like 34 still when, when that disappeared. So let's see. 44 is what I'm going to guess is when that's going to uh, skip. That was 43. Okay, so nine seconds. So that might be what they have it set at is nine seconds. All right, so here's this guy coming by. This is a whole, you know, 
quite a bit later. So he's being capped, picked up. Now this red box will pick up his legs coming into the scene. Now this box will pick him up, the rest of them coming in. Then he leaves at 45. So I'm going to guess at 55, this will switch. Yep, 55. And then, oh yeah, and then he actually, um, if you look at that, he actually came back. It's crazy. So let me go back. Look at that again. Yeah, so it's 58. See, what happened was, is that's actually a whole um, minute. Like, I think it was two minutes, if I remember correctly. 456. I'm going to try to get back to that guy with the red hat again. Okay, here he is. All right, so it's 4.32 and 36 seconds right now. So 4.32 and 45 seconds. So 4.32 and 45 seconds. Now watch that. It should be 55. But look at the... Okay, yeah, okay, it did. So right, it switched, but then a, one minute exactly later, he set off the motion sensor... Nine seconds after exactly a minute later. <laughs> it's hard to explain that to you, but there's a buffer. Now, as soon as he, uh, I don't know if he takes it right here. I think he walks down there. So he might be picked up for a lot of his walk down there because he's still in red, red, red. He's still being picked. Now he's not. So about 28, he's, he'll already be in the elevator area. You'll see him walk by. Yeah, see, he's right there. And now, 20, and now it just skipped a long time. So that's exactly right. It was 10 seconds after the red box disappeared. You know, 9 or 10 seconds. All right, so it's really obvious, if you just watch the videos, how consistent they all are, except people want to call that glitching because it sounds nefarious. Oh, my God. Something's glitching. Here, let's do the uh, pass elevator. Same, same deal. All right, let's just move it forward to maybe around this time. All right, so the red box disappears. Okay, and that was 01. Now, I bet you that stops counting at a 10 or 11. Although the elevator door, yeah, that was right, 10 or 11. The elevator door didn't keep the motion going. It was too far back. So he comes out. Now watch, right when it disappears, boom, that was 23. Now, I bet 33 is when this will stop recording. Because there's a buffer. And, oh, it just started to get to 34, but yep. And let's see what the next motion is. I'm just going to show you a bunch of these so that you know that it's consistent. The elevator set that one off. Okay, at 320 even. So at 10, that should go away to the next. Yep, went right to the next one. <laughs> That's perfect. All right. And I don't know what this next motion is. I, I didn't... Uh, okay, right there, the elevator opened up at 56. So, so I'm going to say at 6 seconds right now. Yep, so it's right, just hit 7 there. So just watch this right there. Now as soon as this guy leaves... Okay, right, right, right when the, the boxes disappear, that was 33 on the dot. Now, when the door shuts, it might set it off again, and that will add... To, yep, right there. So, that's going to add 10 seconds. So, now it's going to go to uh, 49 or 50 up here. Yep, went to 49. Now, we're at 227. I don't know what this motion was, because sometimes you can pick a, get a uh, sense motion off to the side, and then... It, like right there, that motion sensor went off, right? And I don't know why. Sometimes it just does with... These aren't perfect devices. See how it's kind of pixelated a little bit? And it sort of shifts. Maybe that was. Maybe that's what picked it up. I don't know. But that's what you'll all focus in on is that one moment, though. So here's the red boxes. So this, this door will not set off the motion sensor because of the angle. Red's gone at 32. Now at 42... That should stop recording, and then I think they go straight to the Kanika. So, yeah, 41 it stopped, and now here's Kanika. 
All right. So she comes out, and then the red box hits her. Now, if you went back nine seconds, that's when the, the elevator door set it off. Okay. Now, here she is. She's going to walk by the camera. Turned off. Now, there's 25. It was 17. So, at 27, maybe 26, it'll uh, skip. Yeah, so it was 26. So that's why there's a gap, okay? And then when she gets caught, picked up by the next camera, it rolls back eight seconds, and there's a 10-second gap between this video here and, and this one. Okay, I'm going to open it up just so we can have them right next to each other, side by side. I was going to do this on the... Uh, on you know share my screen with the guy that made this video but he's just all over the place you know clowning around you know acting like he's just really discovered something big you know it's ridiculous so uh let's see so i'm just gonna do it here yeah so see right there that's right when kanika showed up so it was around you know 33 maybe there so we're missing about seven seconds of actual you know camera recording something Okay, that's because she's over here and she's walking slowly and she doesn't get picked up till here and then the buffering only goes back nine seconds. Okay, so I hope this clears everything up for everybody and if you want, go. I'll put the link to the um, Jonathan Cruz case on Crime Watch Daily in my description and you should check it out. That story, is, that case is still active. Um, it's not... I think it's called active, but just not being worked on. Or it's open, but not active. Something like that. Um, so, anyways, I hope that explained everything. And I will talk to you later. I'm, I'm rambling on. Bye.